horny hoes and bitches. You guys who just can't keep your wangy 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 in your pants. Or in other cooches. Stick to your own cooch. Cheating. Cheating happens all the time in relationships. Especially young teen relationships. Which is who I'm addressing this to. I've really never uh, seen the point of cheating. I mean, if you're in a relationship, I believe you should be respectful to that relationship and be a trusting person. I mean, if you want to go fuck some other girl, then you shouldn't be in a relationship. Same thing goes for you girls. If you want to go have sex with some other guy, you shouldn't be in a relationship. Look, if you, if you happen to be in a relationship, you're liking this person, and then eventually, down the line, you kind of like get tired of that person, and then you meet somebody new, and like, oh damn, you're horny self, you just can't control it, you just need to get it in, the right thing to do would first break up with your current boyfriend or girlfriend, and then go do whatever the hell you want with this new person. Don't just sleep with them and then keep it from so-and-so. Like, that's just not right. For me, whatever I do to somebody, before I do it, I think about how would I feel if this happened to me. Me, I've never cheated, ever. Yeah. And I never plan to. I, I find that very wrong, to cheat. Cheating is wrong, end of story, period. Even if you, if, even if you get tired of the person or you just feel like they don't care anymore, or you're just not getting that attention from them anymore, then you gotta have, you gotta, you're gonna have to talk to them. You need to talk to them, tell them what's going on. If they don't communicate, then, well, you gotta dump them. Just, just dump them and then go do whatever the hell you want with this new person. And there's the cheaters that, uh, they want to have that, that boyfriend because he's there to, to help me and support me and to, uh, cuddle with me when, when I need him. He's there for me. But then when you're getting freaky in the club and he ain't there, baby, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> That's not right, because your boyfriend's actually being a good boyfriend, and you're over here. Screaming like never before. That's just wrong. It's wrong. You gotta know it's wrong. And then there's a time when you know he's cheating, so you feel like, eh, well fuck it, I'ma cheat too. Okay, now what's the point of the relationship right now? There's no relationship. You guys are just, it's not working. Not working. Dump, dump. Beep. If you're both cheating, it's not working out anymore. The end. And then, then the girls that are crying will be like, Oh, my boyfriend cheated on me. Oh. When last weekend you cheated on him, but it's not a big deal because you didn't get caught. That's just that's just wrong. <laughs> no, that's just not right. Cheating is wrong. That's it. Would you like to be cheated on? I didn't think so. Or if you've been cheated on. Did you like it? I don't think you did. I don't think so. Well, that's my opinion about cheating. If you agree with me, feel free to like this video. Comment this video if you disagree or whatever other shit. Or you just want to tell me something pretty and nice. On, uh... Yeah. Free feel to share this to your friends. Be free to share this to the person who cheated on you or some shit. Or, yeah. And uh, don't forget to subscribe because that shit makes me happy and I will love you. Wink, baby. Uh, chinga, chinga, chinga. Oh, baby, I like it.